Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to design and animate this beautiful infographic. This template has picture placeholder to add your custom images. So let's get started. First enable the guides and then go to slide master. Delete all the default placeholders from this slide and then go to insert placeholder. Select the picture placeholder and draw rectangle shape to cover half of the slide. This will be our picture placeholder. Format this placeholder with some pattern fill. Now click on close master view to exit from slide master. Go to layouts under home tab then select the layout which we have just designed in slide master. Click on the image icon at the middle of this placeholder and add your own custom image into it. Next go to insert tab and draw rectangle covering this entire image. Make it no outline and fill it with the dark blue color. Increase the transparency so that the image is slightly visible at the back end. Now go to insert tab and draw circle holding down shift key. Align it along the image and fill it with dark grey color. Change its outline color and also increase its weight to 4.5 points. Again go to insert tab, draw another circle holding down control and shift keys. Both circles must be co-centric to each other. Make it no outline and fill it with the outline color of first circle. Select both circles and drag them holding down control and shift keys to create the duplicates. Create three more such duplicates and make sure the distance between each duplicate is same. Group all the circles and align it centrally to horizontal guide. Now ungroup all the circles and then change the colors. Next go to insert tab and draw rectangle shapes to fill the gap between each circles. You can drag this shape holding down control and shift keys to create duplicates. Holding down control key, select all the circle shapes and bring them to front. Add all text fields in PNG icons to finalize our design. Let's speed up to save time. 
So this is how the design looks like. Next we will proceed to animation portion. Let's enable the animation pane and begin our animation process. Move the rectangle shape so that we can select the back end image. Next apply wipe animation to the selected image and increase its duration to 1 second. Bring back this rectangle to its original position and apply wipe animation. Change effect options to top, start it with previous and increase its duration to 1 second. Next select small rectangle shape, apply wipe animation and change effect options to top. Select both our circles and apply zoom animation. Start them after previous and for second circle, set the delay duration to 0.25 seconds. This will create ripple effect between both circles. Select PNG icon, apply zoom animation, and start it after previous. Finally select the first heading text, and apply split animation. Change effect options to vertical out, and start it with previous. Let's preview the animation once. That looks perfect. Now making use of animation painter, apply same set of animations to other similar design elements. Make sure to apply all animations in the same sequence as before. Next select main title text and apply split animation. Select heading text and again apply split animation. Change its effect option to vertical out and start it with previous.
Next select the rectangle shape and apply wipe animation. Change its effect options to left and start it after previous. Lastly, select the text field and apply split animation. Change effect options to vertical out and start it with previous. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment.